Damn. Bro, he cursed him while he was still alive? That's a little... Janky. Yeah. I will kill you and defile your corpse. Then the pox will truly be your own. Thanks. Oh, God. of Milos. Oh. Oh. Sinister greatsword fashioned from a giant's backbone meets out wounds like a lopsided saw blade and restores some FP upon defeating an enemy? That becomes a combo when you use the Shriek of Milos. Oh, man. Should I upgrade this thing, chat? I, I'm like... I don't wonder if I should upgrade this thing. I think I might. It's crazy. It does bleed too. Yeah, yeah, it does. And then we, so wait, if I'm getting this, if I'm thinking about this properly, this means that every time we kill an enemy, we would get back mana and health now, which would be, do I have to do the dual wield attack for that? Does it matter what I kill them with? I do. Oh my God, this bug. Stop, stop. Defeated by a mosquito. <laughs> Getting killed by a skater, chat. Um, so be, because I just killed Dung Eater there, does that mean I can't give him the potion? Or is he like back at the round table now? Oh, I still can't. Round table. Perfect, 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 perfect. Thank you, chat. Bowdy's with the 51 months! I went to sub and then I saw there was an option for me to sub because I had Amazon Prime. Wow, much value. How did I not know about this before? Says Pouty EQ with the 51 months of support. Thank you, my man. I appreciate you. Thank you. Uh, okay. So now we're going back to here. Uh, ER guide. We'll get you to the quest map. Yep. This is the quest uh, right here. Excuse me. When you look in the quest guide, this is the map. And the other one is the guide. The guide is the checklist. If you're looking for like the 274 point checklist, that's the guide. Yep. Mm -hmm. And then the quest map is what I was just looking at. Oh, I didn't realize we could keep buying that stuff here. Awesome. This stuff's actually really good. Oh, hi. 
There you are. You warded off my blessing, despite the curse stirring within you. No one has succeeded in that before. How? I thought. Then it hit me that you are, in fact, me. And I am the Dong Eater. It is my flesh that must receive the blessing. Give me your blessing. Defile my flesh with the seed bed curse again and again until it is done. Until a cursed ring coalesces that may one day defile order itself. Countless I have killed, and countless I have defiled, and soon the fruits will be born. Hundreds will be reborn cursed, and they'll bear thousands of cursed children, who bear tens of thousands more. A few of those will be born just like me, and they'll kill and defile and bless in my stead the rotten fools. My fate was the grandest, most brilliant of them all. My corporeal flesh lies in the sewer jail beneath the capital. Give it your blessing. Defile my flesh with the seedbed curse until a curse ring coalesces that may one day defile order itself. So that's interesting. So I wonder, like, he calls himself the Dung Eater, and he talks about defiling corpses. So everyone's like, oh, yeah, he eats poop, right? Yeah, a little disgusting. But we're defiling his corpse with seedbed curses. So I wonder if that's just how he does it to everyone else. I wonder if he's just, like, planting the curse in the corpse. And then that, like, defiles the bloodline. I think that's what's happening. Interesting. My corporeal hmm. flesh lies in the sewer jail beneath the cup. Give it your blessing to So wait. Do I have to do this whole five seedbed thing to give him the potion? I thought I just gave him the potion. No? I was gonna say, I don't, I, if I do that, that, that takes us right down the line we don't wanna go down. Okay. Did I read the seed best, seedbed curse description? I don't know if I have. Curse grown on a body defiled by the dung eater. Oh. Curse grown on a corpse killed and defiled by the dung eater. A tender pox afflicted with omen horns. The dung eater cultivates the seedbed curse on corpses. By doing so, he prevents the dead souls returning to the Erd tree, leaving them forever cursed. One of the more lonesome things found in all the lands in between. Everyone he curses, he is basically just removing from the cycle. Hmm. Well, I took you from that matter. Lay out your own. More. More. I need more. Um, what am I sell? I need to sell some stuff. I haven't sold dupes in a while. Uh, my kingdom for a sell all duplicates button. Uh, Mr. Dahlgren, I will absolutely make sure not to mention, put that on the screen or talk about it. Thank you so much. Sounds horrifying. Dang it. Okay, we need to come back and we get a few more souls. Will you be playing Kingdom Come Deliverance before the second one releases? Yes. Yes, I will. Okay, so now we go back to the same place we found him, I'm assuming, right? How long is KCD1? Kind of depends on how much you do. There's a lot of side stuff. Um, our playthrough will probably be relatively main story focused, but I do want to do any kind of like iconic side questing. Um, but I, if I remember right, you can get you can get anywhere from like 
15 to 50 hours. Like, it's it's pretty long and it's pretty big, depending on how much you want to go. Are you watching the Xbox Showcase? Yes, I'm sorry. I need to add that to my title. Too many people are not seeing that. Oh, there was the bleed. Ooh. That hit hard. Oh, Renark, nice. I need to get my primary back in. I think, what do we need? A somber six now? The only thing I don't like about this sword is it doesn't um, scale at all with faith. Which kind of stinks. We're definitely a faith character. So that's unfortunate. And I don't think we can do anything to uh, increase that, really. Yeah, unfortunately, I think I might have lost my opportunity at getting the... Uh, the FP amulet. I, Looking back, I might have wanted to pick that up. But I think it's too late now because we already ate the soul. Any tips on how to beat Dracula? I have no idea. Have you seen the new MechWarrior game? It's called MechWarrior 5 Clans? No, I haven't. We can dupe the remembrances, just dupe it at the walking mausoleum. You know, I might, I'm thinking about that. I, I, I know we can do that. I was considering it. I mean, we could drop our, like, jump attack for FP back. We could also drop, I mean, we've got a ton of HP. We could drop some HP for it. We got options. Kind of want to wear that just so I could say I have a, a, a bowl on my head. Mm. Oh, that looks pretty good. Nah, <laughs> he's got such a tiny little head. Uh, I want to go to the main head, but this will be fine for now. Make it Hi. He's <laughs> fine. children and their children's children <laughs> for all time to come <laughs> cool have a potion no oh, I am the dung eater oh, I am Bro, is that it? I've never done this. <laughs> um, okay. I guess we go talk to Saluvius. Oh, reload, reload. Okay. Oh, chat saying don't reload. Banned forever. Banned forever. Who, who else told me to reload? Hold on. Let me see here. Um, let's see who else. Uh, K. 
Okay. Great, we're good. Awesome. Am I standing? I am. Was I kidding? Yes. I don't even think I was going to use that armor. Oh, wait. I'm not supposed to joke ban people anymore. I'm sorry to you two guys. Um, I just remembered I'm not actually supposed to do that because I think you just got banned at, like, everywhere in our infrastructure because we have a bunch of scripts that auto-run whenever we ban someone. Um, that's my bad. But hopefully this will teach you in the future to be careful about posting stuff in, in public chat rooms. This is this is both on me and you. This is, there was, this, it takes two to tango. So, yeah. Yeah. You're going to have a bunch of problems on our infrastructure, but really it's your fault at the end of the day. Okay, so, oh, let's see. Moving forward. Um, all right. So if we had stayed in the game, then eventually his armor just would have popped up. Is that what would have happened? Like what 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 did we do wrong there? Out of curiosity. Oh, we, if we would have killed him. Oh, so now wait, if we would have killed him for our armor, could we have still used him as a summon? Oh, you can. Interesting. Okay, well, that's alright. We can always new game plus and go get it again if we really want to. Falcon kick to the balls. Nice. Okay. Yeah, Yiggs, I, I might have forgotten. Won't happen again. It'll definitely happen again. Let's be real. Let's be real. Hmm. Don't worry, the armor's gross anyway. Okay. Oh, so what was I talking about? So basically, Barry has this in intricate spider-like machination where, like, any time certain stuff is detected in chat, it sends off, like, a whole cacophony of, of scripts and, and things that happen all across our, our many different networks. So in... Oh, oh, we got to talk to Salubius first. So in this case, um, <laughs> if I ban someone as a joke, the scripts don't always know it's a joke, and then they get banned on the website and the Discord and the mobile app and <laughs> all sorts of fun stuff. It's like a it's like a giant nuke <laughs> that goes off whenever we ban someone. So, um, yeah, we got to be a bit more careful. The bodies hit the floor. They do. They, the bodies do indeed hit the floor. Yeah. Many bodies. Lots of bodies. Yeah, and then after you get banned from all of our infrastructure, then it starts moving through local fast food joints that you're... That, so first you get banned from McDonald's and then uh, Burger King... Pizza Hut, Taco Bell, Chipotle. Uh, it just it just goes down the list. Yep, <clears throat> it's tough. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Royce says only the brothels remain. Yeah, I would never ban anyone from brothels. I'm not a monster. Come on now. Jeez. Um, my lord. Ko, you joke banned me three weeks ago, and, and I couldn't go into my local gym last week because of you. Please fix. I, that's kind of on your fault, yeah. So wait, you basically dung eater the banned people? Yes. That's exact. That's actually exactly what we do. That's that's. We should, in fact, we should just call it dung eatering moving forward instead of banning. Yeah, we defile them. We don't ban people here. We defile them. Yes, and all their little children on the different platforms. <laughs> they all become defiled. <laughs> ah, so you made Nefali for generations to come. Anytime well you make done. an account, banned instantly. You touch more useful, defiled. Than I had thought. Very well. Then you shall have your gift. Knowledge of the sorceress arts. I will render you maidenless. I doubt much of it will lay within the grasp of a mere tarnished, but if you put your mind to it, perhaps you won't embarrass our lady. Oh. Yes, I will defile you and leave you maidenless. Or sirless, whatever your preference. It's 2024. Incorrigible lout. Don't you dare okay. waltz back here ever again. I'm going to talk to you. What about now? Oh! Um, 
Turtle Pope! Turtle Pope! <clears throat> Hold on. Hold up. Let's see if this actually works. I don't think I've ever had this work before. I really wonder if this will work. What happened? I accidentally hit an NPC and he got super angry. So I think we can do this. This this will do it, right? Did I do that on purpose? No, I actually dropped my controller and the trigger hit my, my wrist rest. Okay. Your sins are absolved. So what we just did, theoretically, is made it so when we go back here, he's going to be there and act like we didn't attack him. So let's see if it works. This The Celestial Dew system was specifically designed so if people accidentally, like, do what I just did, essentially, um, they're still able to fix their game. Let's see if it worked. Yeah, I think you can also bring back people you kill. So I think if you actually, if you, and correct me if I'm wrong there, chat, you can kill a quest NPC and bring them back with that, right? Or is it only, oh, no, 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 it's not. It's not how it works. Okay, I'm sorry. So, so the only thing you can do is make them nice again, essentially. Yeah, I was thinking, yeah, that's DD2. Dragon's Dogma 2, you can bring back people, um, but not this game. Okay. Cool. <clears throat> Thank you for the clarification there. So he's already back, which is great. You wish to begin right this moment? Well, your impatience, though boorish, is understandable. Awesome. Let's have at it. Okay, hold on. I want to make sure we do this right. Uh, we are over at Saluvius. We're down here. We are if we we are on this step, but we're not going to do this yet because we're going to do this first. Can I? Can I ask about the puppet room? Ah, this great. You break into a man's private chambers, rooting about as you please. Your oafishness knows no bounds. Fine and well. You tricked Nefeli and had her drink the potion. I believe that makes you my accomplice. You yearn for a puppet of your own. Well, normally one of your stature would never be allowed. But perhaps I can make a very special exception. I did not give it now, to Nefeli. I think I lied to him. Choose. Does it matter? I think I'm going to get Jarboy. Because I like Jarboy. Um, I'm going to get Jarboy. About Nephili. So, you had Nephili drink the potion? Truly? No. Hmm. Then perhaps something was amiss with it. It's concocted from the finest ingredients, but perhaps I should review the recipe. I may have expected too much of her to begin with. Begging for another lesson? Ugh, there remains much to be done. This is just for spells, right? Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna try resting real quick because I think. I'm pretty sure something we haven't given him any starlight shards. We haven't, we haven't done, I'm supposed to talk to him about the puppet room and then find three shards, but we're, we're missing whatever's here. Maybe that's what we're doing now. I think you got to buy a spell from him. You have to, oh, you have to exhaust his entire store. I did say to buy everything there. Buy all sorceries and two puppets. But then... Okay. I, I, the shards were before that step, so I assumed we didn't have to do that to do that, but... Didn't we stop his quest? I don't think so. 
Like begging for another letter, that I mean. Weird. Okay. So I already have I mean I already have shards. Are you talking about these? I have four of them. Begging for another. Ugh, Let me try one more time. Yeah, minus one's fine. Okay. Rest at a bonfire, maybe? Okay. Yeah, it's leave, not discard, but it's fine. We, we, they're, they're consumables. Like, it's not a big deal. You need a super special one in Altus if you haven't gotten one yet. Oh, so, so there's like one shard we How's have. A thing of exquisite craft, is it not? I want a new puppet. What's that? You want another puppet? Quite the keen paramour, aren't we? But I'm afraid each. That's interesting. We had to rest twice, essentially. To me, I the desire to stand fades. Away. Yes, ma'am. Oh dear, what's to be done? Why don't you fetch me some starlight shards? There we go. If you can manage it, I'll gladly prepare a new puppet for you. The soul of every puppet has its own ambience. You'll soon come to know once you possess a few. And once each's predilections are known to you, the better you will be able to love them. Oh yes, you have much to look forward to further down this road. Ah, obtain a puppet. Oh. Oh. We have to buy it. Okay. Learn his plot. We have to buy all the sorceries and two things. Okay. Man. Only I had not deleted a starlight shard. Would have been nice, huh? How much uh, FP do we have total? 137. So we can, have, we can absolutely summon him. Um... Didn't we do this? In the, in this where uh, off brand God Godric was? Yeah, we did him. We we did off brand Godric. Um. <clears throat> oh wait, no, or was that up here? Wait. No, no, that was the right one. That was the right one. Yeah, that was that was off brand Godric. Um. So we need to get two more shards. There are three puppets you can. I want to get the dung eater puppet though. I think the dung. I think using the dung eater to fight my fights. Is, is like the best thing we could do with him. I love that. I love the idea of murdering him and then using him to kill things that he doesn't want killed. I like that. <laughs> yep. So, there's one near the Bestial Sanctum if you haven't gotten it yet. Okay. That's Overture. 